Well, it's amazing really because this is where it all began. This is where professional rugby began in 1995 where I first came to see a game and where Michael Liner came in disguise to watch a game and see what the place was like and despite that he joined the club which was amazing. And I look back at it now and I think, gosh, so you, you had Liner, Seller, Pinar, all that lot training here, but that was rugby in those days, that was professional rugby. And I can still remember a conversation in 1996 when we discussed whether we should have a full-time coach. That's how far the game's come. I've got probably 6'10 now, and you know, it's, it, the professionalism is extraordinary. And Saracens Amateurs, well, they're going to be playing now. And they've now got 60 players. So Touchwood, they're reviving too, which is great. There wasn't any seating. We were all standing around the side of the pitch. There was a barrier, and we were leading up against the barrier. Um, the players were changing in porter cabins, and um, we were playing bath and they had to come out of the porter cabin and walk round to get on the pitch. Some of them decided it was too far to walk round, it was only about 20 yards. They would vault over the uh, barrier where we were standing. And uh, Victor Boga would put his hand on my shoulder and vaulted over me um, to get onto the pitch. And I strained my back somewhat with um, a bath player landing on me, which I wasn't prepared for. Um, but he actually turned around and said, sorry, no, no problem. <laughs> I wasn't going to argue with him. <laughs> yeah, uh, it's really quite funny, it's quite sweet. Uh, he used to do his training with the, with the rest of the squad in the mornings. Then he'd, he'd live locally and he'd pop into the park to practice kicking, but he'd always stick his head through the door saying, it's all right if I go out on the pitch, on the front pitch, and actually practice kicking for the day. Yeah, it was really funny. It was, you know, he'd come and have a cup of tea when it was cold. Well, I prefer the emotion of today to the emotion of, say, 10 years ago when we were sort of didn't really know where we were going, what we were doing, didn't really have an ethos. So we've got seven away with England, the vast majority of whom have come all the way through. They were nothing, they weren't known, and actually, so it shows that you know, people coming through the academy, coming through the system, which involves Saracens amateurs, is, is, is amazing. And of course what they then do is they carry on the, what the club stands for and they hand it on in terms of the people who follow them and hopefully so it goes on and we build and build and build.